Good morning, John Marshall. I'm Raymond Steed. And I'm Angie Hot. Here are the morning announcements for Wednesday, March 16th, 2022. Students, please be sure you are checking your email regularly. Important information is being sent to you daily, and you may miss forms, deadlines, and more if you are not checking your email. If you need help accessing your email, please ask a teacher for assistance. Attention seniors, Andy Hanaski from Pipe Fitters Local 83 will be here on Tuesday, March 22nd at 1 p.m. to speak to in interested students. He will be located in room 284. If, if you are interested, you can sign up in Mrs. Knutson's office at room 142. There will be a clipboard on the door for signups and you will receive a hall pass that morning to attend. The yearbook staff wants you to be in the book. Portrait days are scheduled for any student who missed picture day in the fall. Please report to the Mac Lab, room 252, on your scheduled day during first period. These photos are not for sale and for use in the book only. Ninth grade will be March 16th, 10th grade will be March 17th, 11th grade will be March 18th, and 12th grade will be March 21st and the 22nd. List of students who need to report will be posted on the wall outside of the lab and around the school. The class of 2023 is selling pies from the pie shop. The sale will run from March 10th to March 24th. All pies are freshly made right before they are delivered. The delivery date is April 7th, just in time for Easter. And all pies can be frozen. They are only $10 each. Any junior who needs sales form can see Mrs. Walton in room 258 or Mrs. Yates in room 371. Advisors will try to get forms out to you through your 11th grade English teacher too. Monarch Company at John Marshall High School is excited to present the, musical, the classic beloved musical, The Wizard of Oz. Familiar songs, colorful costumes, and characters, and story full of fantasy and heart will surely bring smiles to all who attend. Shows will take place on Friday, March 25th at 7 p.m., Saturday, March 26th at 2 p.m., and Sunday, March 27th at 2 p.m. Tickets are $5 for students and senior citizens and $8 for adults. Tickets can be purchased on the JMHS website, johnmarshallhs.com, or at the door. The cast features 23 high school and 18 elementary aged actors, along with a tech crew of 10 JM students. The show is directed by Aaron Bond and is perfect for the entire family. Hosts would like to thank all the, all the students who signed up to donate blood at the March 21st blood drive. Extra permission slips are available in room 383 and students are reminded to turn in their completed permission slips to either room 383 or the nursing classroom. Donors are asked to drink plenty of fluids both the day before and the day of the blood drive. All high school juniors and seniors are invited to attend the statewide WV Solution Seekers Student Leadership vi Virtual Conference on Friday, April 8th. Students will have the opportunity to join state and national leaders for a jam-packed day of workshops, networking opportunities, and many giveaways. To learn more and to register, visit wvsolutions.net. You can also email Brittany Bruce at brittany.bruce at marshall.edu with questions. The first 100 students to register get a free exclusive t-shirt. The West Virginia Virginia Department of Education is excited about its joint venture with the Marshall University Luge College of Business and Brad D. Smith Schools of Business as they usher in another session of the West Virginia Governor's School of Entrepreneurship. Marshall University will welcome students in ni grades 9 through 11 from June 19th to July 9th for this free and exciting venture. Students will live in well chaperoned residence halls on campus and have meals in the university dining hall. They will also have access to many opportunities provided on campus. Applicants can, should show a passion for creating a product or idea and possess a learning style that will thrive in a creative and innovative environment. They are also looking for students with computer and programming skills, building skills, an engineering background, business skills, creative minds, and the willingness to take a chance to succeed. To learn more or to apply, you can visit the Governor's School website at govschools.wv.gov slash GSE. The deadline to apply is March 25th, 2022. 
Attention seniors, West Virginia Northern Community College will be at John Marshall on Friday, March 18th at 1 p.m. To, to speak about the upcoming Summer Fast Track welding program. There's a $50,000 grant to help students pay for classes and questions about enrollment will be answered. If you would like to participate, please sign up in Ms. Knutson's office at room 142. There will be a clipboard inside the door for signups and you will receive a hall pass that morning to attend. Current juniors can enter for a chance to win a full scholarship to West Virginia Wesleyan College. The winner will receive four years of room, board, tuition, and fees. For the official rules and application instructions, visit wvscholar.com. National Honor Society is currently holding a blanket drive. To participate, please bring a new or gently used blankets to the counseling office. Blankets will be donated to the Shepherd's Pantry to help Ohio Valley citizens who are in need. The drive will run now through March 18th. Juniors and seniors, the Ladies League of Marshall County is hosting the Cinderella Project with the goal to help students with prom. If you would like assistance, you can see your counselor. Applications are now available for the John Marshall Trust Fund scholarships. These include many service-based, performance-based, and need-based scholarships. For a complete list of scholarships or to apply, visit the Guidance Office, Guidance Office or John Marshall High School website. You may also receive one by emailing members of the Trust Committee, your counselor or minister, Mr. Mandarino. Application deadlines are Wednesday, April 6th at 9 a.m. Now let's take a look at today's lunch menu. Monarch Lane and Pride Alley will both be serving freshly baked pepperoni rolls with marinara sauce. In the hot sandwich line, you can get, a, get turkey and cheese on croissant, or in the cold sandwich line, you can get an egg salad sandwich. There will also be a pizza variety offered in the pizza line. Today's salad entree will be Santa Fe fajita salad. Sides offered today include cottage cheese, garlic steamed broccoli, carrots, and snickerdoodle cookie, and a salad bar. Now let's take a look at today's events. Tonight, the junior varsity and varsity baseball teams will take on Parkersburg South. Varsity will play at home and JV will play in Parkersburg. Both games begin at 5 p.m. Also tonight, the varsity softball team will travel to Union Local School for a scrimmage. That game will begin at 5.30 p.m. For a complete list of this weekend's activities, check out the Athletics tab of John Marshall High School website. Thank you for listening to the morning announcements. I'm Raymond Steed. And I'm Angie Hot. Have a great day, Monarchs.